Good morning, family. Good morning, family. Don't forget, grow some trees, grow some food, grow something. Let's get started. The garden is completely overgrown. It has been so much going on and I have just let it go completely wild. Look at this. The lantana is all the way over and just completely blocking this whole pathway. It has been so hot. We are averaging 101 to 108 every day for weeks now. It's only about 91 right now. So I thought that I might be able to get out here and get a little bit of work done. At least try to clear some of these pathways and maybe get out here this evening to cut this grass. The lawnmower is still broken and I haven't gone to get a new one because I think this one is beyond repair. So I've still been cutting it with the weed eater. If you've ever had to do that before, you know that's a lot of work. I did come out here last week and pulled most of everything out of these beds out here still too hot to start fall seeds. I'm sorry I was not able to take you guys along with me this summer as I went through my gardening chores, but uh, it's been a rough one, a really rough one. I will make a separate video explaining everything that has happened but uh, we have been dealing with a lot of loss, a lot of loss. And uh, the uh, last one that I just had to deal with was a really hard one. It was my 16 year old niece. So as I said, that is going to be a completely different video that I will share with you guys everything that has been going on. But right now I am going to get started on clearing all of this because like I said, it is a lot. It is a complete jungle back here and there's no telling what is living <laughs> back here. And uh, yeah, all right, let me quit talking and procrastinating and uh, get started. Okay guys, see you in a minute. You are gorgeous, look at you. This is the Cape Plumbago. If you guys haven't seen previous videos, this was in the ground in a shaded area. It wasn't doing too well. I dug it up. I thought maybe I had killed it, but I didn't. It bounced back and uh, it is actually in a container that you can't see right now. <laughs> because like I said, it is a jungle out here. But uh, I'm gonna try to remedy that really quickly. Whew. All right, you guys see this? This is the African daisies and the evening primrose. And uh, yeah, it's a serious hot mess. So, whew, I gotta get that done. I've already taken care of both sides of this arbor here. 
So I've got this pile here, I've got that pile over there, and uh, the same with my big beast over here. So I'm making a dent in a lot of this. But uh, like I said, those temperatures are climbing and uh, <laughs> I am dripping out here with sweat. Look how long this grass is. That is completely ridiculous. But like I said, it's, it's been a rough one and uh, it's gonna get done. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get this stuff right here out of here, take out all of the spent plants all of the weeds that have grown through here. And uh, hopefully tomorrow, because I think it's gonna be 101 today, so I'm gonna have to quit pretty soon. But tomorrow morning, I'll be able to get right back out here and get some more work done. You guys wanna see the uh, lantana? Look at all of this. And it's still not as cut down as far as I want it to. So I'll come back out here tomorrow and uh, take that down a little bit further. But like I said, I am making a dent in all of this. All right, guys, so it is day two. Whew. We did hit 101 yesterday. It is going to be 105 today. Some forecasts say it's gonna be 109. Not sure, but uh, while the backyard is mostly shaded, I am out here trying to get this done. When I tell you guys, this grass was so high. Look at that. So I've been doing this all with the weed eater again. And uh, I think this time is actually going to make me break down and go buy another lawnmower. Because, uh, yeah, holding this guy steady for about an hour is a uh, kind of murder on your arms and your back. But, uh, all right, I'm not going to talk too much because, like I said, it's going to be 105 today. And uh, I got a lot of work to do. So I'm going to at least get this all knocked down. I'm gonna try to get it all raked up. If not, it will get raked up tomorrow morning. So hopefully this will not be a three day process, but uh, I don't know, depending on how hot it gets within the next hour, it just might be.
Hispanic family. <laughs> Sorry if this camera is shaking, but uh, my hands are shaking right now. So, uh, yeah, I knocked all of this down and uh, I'm about to rake it up. And then I am heading inside to the shower because I am drenched right now to the point that sweat is stinging my eyes. Whew. Like I said, it's going to be 105 today. I think it's about 95 right now. But uh, I'm in a shaded area for the most part. So I am just going to clean this up. And uh, I'm going to hit the showers. And uh, pretty sure the rest of this day will be spent inside. All right, family, so it is 97 degrees right now. I have done all that I am going to do for today. I will be back out here probably next week because tomorrow is going to be 109. The next day is going to be somewhere in between 111 and 112. And uh, then we have the Sabbath. So of course I'm not going to be doing anything, but uh, yeah, gonna get most of this cleared out and get back out here into my little sanctuary. I know this isn't an exciting video, especially since I have been gone for so long, but just know I will be back. I am slowly making my way back into normalcy. And uh, yeah, I gotta clean that pond out over there too. Still haven't gotten rid of this bench. I think I am going to sell it. And uh, yeah, so this is done. It's not perfect. It's not even even, but at least I can see the ground now. Oh, but like I said, it's 97 degrees and uh, I have so much sweat in my eyes right now that I can barely see. So I'm gonna end this video right here. And uh, you know, if you guys are still here with me, thank you for sticking with me all of this time. Like I said, I will do a video explaining everything that has been going on. And uh, until then, you guys stay blessed, and I will see you all in the next video.